This video is a sample problem for heat of combustion, okay? Calculations in the laboratory experiments. A 1.55 gram sample of ethanol is burned and produced a temperature increase. When we say temperature increase or decrease, we are talking about delta T or change in temperature. For this problem, it is in 55 degrees Celsius in 200 grams of water. Now we're going to calculate the molar heat of combustion. Now let's proceed. We are given with the mass of ethanol at 1.55 grams. The molecular weights of ethanol or molar mass of ethanol is 46.1 gram per mole. Okay, So how did we get this value? We have the molecular formula for ethanol as C2H5OH. The molecular mass for Carbon dioxide is 12, for oxygen as 16, and for hydrogen as 1. Now, 12 times 2 plus 5 plus 16 plus 1 gives us 46.1 grams per mole. Okay? The excess point 0.1 is actually the detailed molecular weights of those elements. And we are additionally given with water that is heated in these experiments at 200 grams. And this specific heat of water is almost at 4.18 joules per gram degree Celsius. And the temperature increase or change in temperature is 55 degrees Celsius. Now we are required to calculate for the molar heat of combustion or HE. The first one to do is to solve for the moles of ethanol used for this problem. If we are going to solve the number of moles of any compounds, it is calculated as N would be equal to the mass all over molar mass or molecular weight. For this problem, the mass of the ethanol is 1.55 grams, and the molecular weight or molar mass of ethanol is 46.1 gram per mole. This gives us a value of 0 0.0336 moles for the amounts of ethanol that is used for this problem. The second one is we're going to proceed with the heat generated Q. Now, this is very dependent with the heat that is produced through water, okay? So this is calculated as Q is equal to MCP delta T with the parameters as water. So we have the specific heat of water at 4.184 joule per gram degree Celsius multiplied with the mass of the water at 200 grams times the change in temperature at 55 degrees Celsius. Now, simplifying the whole expression gives us 46,024 joules, or if we're going to divide this to get kilojoules, okay, divide it with 8,000 joules for one kilojoule. This gives us 46.024 kilojoules for the heat generated. Now for the experimental molar heat of combustion or molar heat of combustion, we're just going to divide Q with N or the heat energy generated all over moles of the compound used. For this problem, it is ethanol. Now Q all over N. 46.024 kilojoules per 0 0.0336 mole. This gives us 1,370 kilojoules per mole for this problem.